What is up, everybody? Welcome back and to the channel. Uh, I'm stunned. I'm absolutely flipping stunned right now. And the reason why I'm stunned, right? It's simple. People are making fan art of me now. Honestly, my mind is still blown over the two things I saw. But first, we're going to look at Bunzao's art, right? And by the way, I don't know if you want the your Instagram name on here, but basically, if you do want this video removed for showing you this, uh, Latte the Android, just let me know if you want it removed, and I'll go back and censor it and try to re-upload it later. But just let me know. But anyway, we got Bunzao's art. As you can see, I have both of these images. All of the images saved to my computer, by the way, so I'm never going to forget these. This was art made by Bunzao. And he says, just as promised, but unfortunately I'm really fucking stupid. Like I'm beyond stupid and I have the worst memory ever. So I honestly forgot what you commented in the first place, but I love this. This, this is mind boggling. Basically you got the little orange hoodie that I always wear. It's actually over there somewhere. I'm wearing a gray one today. Got the little uh, beard and mustache. It's kind of growing on me a little bit, a little bit. I don't know if I want to shave it or not, though. I kind of hate facial hair, but I kind of just kept it there for the sake of it. Got the little 2K thing in the hands because I reached 2,000. Got the YouTube icon, and you got the little music icon because I work on music as a side thing. It's fucking dope, dude. And the beanie, the beanie with the curly hair. You can tell my, my I do have curly hair. It does get curly. And why do I wear a beanie, you ask? Check this out. Check this out. Fucking got curly ass hair. Fucking... My God, <laughs> it's all over the place. Almost went feral for a second. <laughs> yeah, the only thing that makes me sad about this image is that it says James does stuff, right? And I'm known as James does stuff now, but like I said, on January 29th, 2024, the channel name is changing back to James Elife, mainly because that was my uh, channel name from 2014 on an old channel that was the most nostalgic to me. Um... It's going to change, but I still really like this. I really do, and I plan on keeping this forever. It's really, really dope. And it makes so much sense. Every detail is pretty much perfect. Kind of. Except my eyes are blue. I have blue eyes. And I'm look. they look kind of just like pupils, but that's the only thing I'd say about that. Other than that, it's pretty much perfect. I love it. So thank you. Thank you. Now, like I said, Latte, I'm going to show this page. If it upsets you that your uh, Instagram is shown, just let me know if you want it taken down and I'll re-upload it. But if you're cool with it, we'll just leave it at that. I'm trying to be respectful to everybody here. She drew my my pony OC. My pony OC that my buddy Red made for me, like I think a year or two back. And we he was going to make more on it, just he got really busy and a lot went on. And... She kind of asked me, I actually have the comment right here. Check this out. Um, I don't have the first comment because I don't remember where the hell it is because I've been getting so many comments on my videos. But she said, oh, by the way, I did finish your drawing. I just don't know how to send. Ah, I have it posted on my Insta though. I set my Instagram and then they tagged me and boom, I just saw my OC. I like this so much. I had to make it my fucking profile picture. Because, you know, I had my OC as my profile picture, and then I had my face for a minute, just, just a little bit, not too long. And then this was sent to me. And because it's a brony channel, I like having my OC as my profile picture. So, of course, I made it my profile picture. I mean, obviously, dude, like, go here, boop, boop, go to my channel, boop, pause that? that shit, boop. Look at that, my profile picture, just as spicy as ever. And I get, look at that. I got a heart from Bunzo. <laughs> but anyway, thank you to the both of you who made the fan art of me. I appreciate it. Honestly, the years have been pretty rough. There's been some really rough times. 2020, 2020, I can't talk. 2020 sucked because my mental state was just in a drag. Uh, 2021 really sucked because my dad died and my mental state was just shitty. 2022 was just trash. I didn't care about 2022 much. 2023 was probably the worst year of this century so far. I really did not like how 2023 turned out. But 2024 is on an amazing fucking start because I've met so many kind people, such talented people that want to make me art. And I appreciate that. I will keep these images forever. I will never let them go, genuinely, from the bottom of my heart. 
And I try to like respond to as many of you guys as I can, or at least heart your messages. Cause I get, I've been getting a lot of comments due to the MLP horror series that I'm currently working on. And I got my buddy Wistful jumping in on the train too. He's been uploading some MLP horror too. Hopefully he, it'll help him get up there. I actually recommended him to start that. That way he could get some views and it's something cool that would get him back into the Brony community. And he seems to like it. So we're chilling. But anyway, I love y'all. Thanks for subscribing. We're already halfway plus to 3000. That is mind boggling. That is mind blowing. But I love y'all. So thanks for subscribing. Thanks for being there. I genuinely appreciate it. And that's all I really got to say. So thanks for watching. And I'll see you all in the next video. Peace. Fuck on life, I can't even make this perfect time